Hello folks, Paul here once again and I have another review for you. This one is for the Maximus Hose by Starbuzz. I've been smoking with this one for a little while now and I feel that I can actually give my opinions on it. Um, it's gigantic. That is the most prominent opinion that I have. Uh, I am not a small guy and at six foot one inch tall you can see that this thing is basically it's it's longer than my entire torso and if I I try to rest it on my body to smoke it actually reaches my temple uh, so I find that to be a little unwieldy if you like large like um, the traditional classic uh, Turkish hoses this is probably a great modern option for you it's got a nice thickness to the handle that fits my uh, hands fairly well and if you're holding it away from your body and smoking you know and you're not lazy like I am then it's actually it's fine it's perfectly fine the bore of the hose itself is actually quite large it is the largest and widest hose that I have um, that includes my Razans, my Nemours, etc. And it's also one of the longest hoses that I have. It is plenty long that you don't pretty much ever have to worry about uh, the hose being too short and pulling a hookah. Uh, so that's really nice to me. The flexibility is really nice. It is a washable hose, so it has kind of that uh, modern flexibility where there's just a little bit of resistance, but it's not quite as flexible as, say... Um, the really traditional leather hoses. For the same reasons, because of uh, the materials that are used, it's also a fairly light hose. I don't worry too much about this hose knocking over my hookahs, which I was kind of surprised by, honestly. Um, I thought that the sheer size of this thing was going to make it pretty weighty, but uh, the relatively light construction and the fairly short hose port end means that this works pretty well with um, every hook I've put it on so far. The ends are what I believe to be cast plastic. Yeah, I can see a seam line there. Uh, it's nice and smooth, feels very sturdy. It's clean and uh, well cut. The interior edge here is just a little bit sharp, but not like you're going to cut your tongue or anything like that. It's just not beveled or, or uh, smooth. And, uh, yeah, the design of the mouthpiece here is very nice. It has this kind of flared piece right here that sits just inside the teeth really well, and I find it very comfortable. Now, the only, um, I guess, complaints that I could say about this hose are that the mouthpiece is non-detachable. It is glued in very, very securely. I have no worries that this is going to, like, pop out while I'm smoking, which is actually an issue that I've had with some other hoses in the past. But it also means that I cannot use my Crown Hookah mouth tips, which I really love, uh, and I think that the uh, kind of cobra-shaped one that I have would go really well with this hose. But uh, that's fine. It's not really that big of a problem. Um, yeah, I mean, if I have any complaint about this thing, it's really just that it is so huge. But for some people, that's a selling point. So I'm not even going to list that as an actual negative. So that's it. This is Paul for Hookah.org saying thank you very much for joining us. Please go down below, like, and subscribe. Give us that thumbs up. Let us know what you think about this gigantic modern washable hose, and I'll see you guys next time. Happy smoking.